if you find that you're sitting for a long time during the day, all of those desk jobs that uh, you might have, uh, you might find the low back gets a little bit stiff and tight. So knowing some easy lower back exercises to reduce tension with the pocket physio can be really useful. Uh, we have three different exercises for you to try uh, in this video. My name's Claire, I'm a physiotherapist from PhysioFit Health. If you're not familiar with the po pocket physio, it is this. Uh, we do have a video just explaining a few more of the features of it if you fancy uh, checking that one out. The first exercise you're going to try with the pocket physio, uh, you need the flat part um, of, um, of it so you can place it against the wall. Uh, this gives you just a little bit of leverage. Um, with that flat part against the wall, you've got that pointy end, uh, which is equivalent to an elbow and can be really useful just to pinpoint um, the different areas that are tight. Now, areas that you were going to um, look for in the low back, uh, you've obviously got the spine uh, running down um, the, the centre, um, and then you've got an area um, either side of the spine, just under the rib cage, um, and it's above the, the hips and the pelvis. So it's it's that area on the right and the left side that you do want to try and target and it does tend to get fairly tight. So flat part of the pocket physio goes um, against the wall, if you can see, uh, with that pointy end sticking out and then you're just going to get uh, the low back uh, squashing the pocket physio against the wall. Now, it might take a little bit of uh, time just for you to move it around and see where, um, where you've got any tight spots. Now, remember, it does have to feel fairly comfortable. Don't make it really painful. It's a little bit counterproductive. Uh, so once you've found that uh, tight spot, um, just for this first exercise, all you're going to do is hold it there. So nice and easy. Um, I would suggest trying to use your breaths um, just to help relax into um, that pressure point. So it is the breath out that taps into the relaxation of the body. Uh, you are going to do five or six really nice big deep breaths. So you're going to breathe in through your nose, really try and fill uh, your lungs. And then breathing out through the mouth. And whilst you're breathing out, you're just trying to consciously relax everything um, around that area of the pocket physio. So nice and straightforward with the first one, five or six uh, big deep breaths. Um, obviously, you're gonna try the other side as well. So your second exercise for the low back, again, you want that flat part against the wall and you want the pointy um, end of the pocket physio finding just a nice tight spot in that low back. Now, my feet are just a little bit further away from the wall, not too far. Um, it's just giving me a bit of leverage so I can put as much or as little pressure onto the pocket physio as I wish to. Uh, now, this one, um, you want to get a little bit of movement with this one. So you're starting with your um, upper body nice and straight. So you can use the wall as feedback. You can get the back of your head against the wall, shoulders. Uh, and then you are going to start a roll down. So you're going to tuck the chin in, which takes the head away from the wall. And then you're slowly going to peel that spine away from the wall, but you want to keep that pressure point um, on that po pocket physio. So you're just going to go down. It's a really short way. You're going to find um, that the tension increases around that area where uh, the pocket physio is. And then you're slowly going to roll yourself all the way back up to your upright position and then start your roll down again. Uh, you are going to aim for your five or six uh, repetitions with this one um, and then work on the other side. Your third exercise that you're going to try, again, flat bit against the wall and you're going to get your low back onto that pointy elbow end. Uh, again, uh, same as the second one, my feet are just a little bit further away from the wall um, with this one, just so I can put the right amount of pressure on for me. Got to feel comfortable. Uh, you are standing nice and upright um, so you can get your back against the wall and the back of the head against the wall. Uh, this time, the movement that you want to do is leaning the body away from your uh, pocket physio. So my pocket physio is on my right side of the low back, so I am leaning over to my left and then um, just standing yourself all the way back upright. So you can do the breathing if you want to, breathing out as you lean over, 
and you're breathing in as you stand yourself back up again. Just staying for your five or six repetitions. You can obviously do more if you want to, uh, and then you are gonna repeat on the other side. So those are your three exercises to try with your pocket physio. Um, that's for the low back. Uh, we do have a couple of videos we've gone through using the pocket physio um, for the neck and also for the shoulders. So check those out. Um, check those out. Uh, desk jobs and sitting for a long time tends to be a bit of a culprit for tension in the neck, shoulders and the low back. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and I'll see you soon.